Welcome back, everybody. For some more company notes. There we go. <laughs> Just a, a little bit of a delayed response. Okay, so last time we kicked things off, we conquered uh, the rest of Greece. And the surrounding areas. So now we need to move on to greener pastures. And by that, I mean we need to start going after uh, Anatolia here. You are dead. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, bring everybody back. We can make one more Varangian because why not? Our legitimacy levels are pretty decent right now. Yeah, I don't know what would stop us getting taxes here from Durachium, but I don't know. The city looks more or less intact. I would give it a solid close enough. All right, scooch back, and we are off. Oh yeah, there's the Byzantine camp over here I forgot about. Um, yeah, find the army camp in northwestern Anatolia. Right now, you can think about it. Anyway, I think this would be the camp over here, right across the uh, Bosphorus. We have secured the camp. Ah. The Turks are all around us. Recruit the men to defend this point, and we will continue the search for survivors. Let's get guard tower. <gasps> Brother has gotten a servant girl pregnant. Bro, homie. Your kinsman, the scandal has damaged your legitimacy by ten points. Gotta keep it in, man. I didn't even know I had a brother. Uh oh, gotta be careful. I wonder if an imp we can get up to galleons. Also, once we get towards Imp, we'll start going more towards the Legionaries and Cataphracts side of things. I think we've played enough with Berserks <laughs> in these campaigns. Alright, so we got that. We're researching Imp. Uh, we're going to go towards Crete and Cyprus. We're going to kill Sakas in uh, Smyrna, I think. What? Come on. These improvements to the imperial administration will also help the army. You can now train legionaries much quicker. Uh, awesome. Awesome, awesome. So we need to find more relics. And I have no idea where they are. Anyway, uh, although there's a castle here, we don't need to worry that much. Alright. Prepare to disembark on enemy shores. Oh, uh, those are mangoes.
We can get you if nothing else. Well, that didn't go so well. Oh, we can get War Galley. Okay, just do a little bit of repairing. Actually, you can repair all these ships. Can I have a moment to breathe while we, uh, you know, don't have much of an army? At least our legitimacy is really high. Despite getting our army obliterated just now. So yeah, our villagers can't build anything but defenses. Alright. You get you get you I wonder if I should start going into more archers. to increase our tax base. Ships are mostly repaired. Where did my other transport go? I had three. I don't think I lost one of them. Whatever. It's not like I have the population for another one anyway. Yeah, Greek Fire and Logistica just do exactly what they do normally. Let's get back on the high seas. I mean, I just don't really think there's a whole lot of point, like... Sure, it might be slightly annoying there. Oh, we can get Drummonds. Ooh. I don't think Drummonds were around last time I played this scenario. I'm not too sure how useful they'll be, but we'll see. Oh, I can't do much there. Oh, 
Oh, nope, there's a mangonel left. Um. Got it. You can deal with that. Now, they do have murder holes, for, unfortunately, for us, but their upgrades aren't that good. Yeah, you need to go, go take that one out. Just would rather not them destroy my docks if at all possible. Attack, please. What on earth are you guys doing? Anyway, we'll get a castle up over here on the, uh, well, the mainland of Eurasia. Anatolia. Got it. I think. Yeah, got smear now. Anyway. Let's start getting some archer upgrades. Note that the market prices always uh, remain the same. We can go for Katas later. They're just a little expensive for what we can do at this point. We can make Bombard Towers! Oh, I definitely don't remember you being able to do that in the original. Mostly because it's, you know, pretty anachronistic. Alright. Oh, seriously? I mean, the towers there are hanging around. Anyway, back to the high seas. Oh, a relic! Okay, so... Let's get you. I mean, even if there wasn't the objective to get relics, I'd still want to get the relic just to get some amount of income. Nope. Can't do that. Not yet. Okay. Yoink! Y-O-I-N-K. Drop you off. I said drop you off. And I don't have that. The ship numbers are looking a little low here as well. Wait, no. Go after that one. 
think I can deal with the fire galley. Although I don't want to sail into unknown waters. With a transport ship. Right. Should be getting to Crete here in a moment. Yeah, these fire galleys aren't going to be able to withstand the war galleys. Not with imp upgrades. Uh, I literally... Yeah. I guess I deserve that one. There's nothing we can really do with the Vils, so I just kind of have to leave them be. Anyway, boom. Got some more Taxaroos. Uh, I guess some Drummonds might not be a bad idea. upgrades. I mean, yeah, eventually those towers are going to go down, but hopefully not for uh, a little bit. Oops. Eh, kind of running out of swordsmen there. Well, we got a drumming on the way. I hear Gaia sounds. What did I just get? Nothing over here. Oh, the legendaries are even more expensive. I guess they have 100 HP, whereas the regular ones have 80, I think? No, 75. Nope. Go after that. The men on the Danube frontier say the Peshenics are on the move. We should send an army to protect our northwestern flank from these heathens. All right, so what I remember, I remember this very clearly. So what's going to happen is the barriers are going to fall, and the Pechenegs are going to just swarm Constantinople. So what we need is a wall of towers and archers. It, should we not go for Bombard Towers because it's anachronistic? But we're going to have to wait until next tax year. Okay, we got Crete. I don't know if Africa is here. Wait, we didn't get Crete? Does not look like it. Oh, we did. Uh. Oh, they've got war galleys now.
that. We got Cyprus. The north is endless step that vomits up endless hordes of horsemen. We can only hold back their tide by building fortifications along the Danube. Well, uh, like I said, there is not a whole heck of a lot I can do until I get more tax revenue. I seriously lost one of my Drummonds to the Fire Galley. I'm such a dum dum. Thankfully, those things aren't expensive. Ugh. Archers to garrison and the towers. And just do what we can. We got Cyprus. Now he spent his days of blind exile. People recognize your victory. Yeah. Alright, get back on the ships. I thought I saw a relic over here. Wishful thinking, I'm afraid. Wait, there is a relic right there. <laughs> All right. I just thought the relic was over there. That's right, you can't shift click for some reason with uh, transport ships. Alright. If the Steppy Boys are going to be after us soon, we're probably going to need to bring people back. Uh, actually, I wonder if the Drummond and whatnot can go after uh, Tripoli. The flesh and eggs are flooding across the Danube. They will soon reach Constantinople. Yep. I remember this bit. Yep. All right, I'll send you guys back. OK, 
Okay, we got that. We'll just bombard those guys from the shoreline. Yeah, they got Kipchoks and Tarkins. There's actually fewer units than our... I remember it being just like, you know, basically an endless tide of enemy units. You? The Lord favors your reign, Alexius. Your piety attracts crusaders from the Western Kingdoms. Oh. I'll take these units. And we lost all our ships. Oh, the gates are a little weak. They're only Feudal Age gates. Okay, I kind of want to rebuild my navy. Can we get Dry Dock and Shipwright? Why not? I can build more gates too, right? Yeah, we'll just rebuild that. Anyway, we're mowing them down. It has a lot of Tarkins left over. more you guys. Get that. Yeah, it looks like we're fine. Back across the Danube. Many of our Romans are dead. But the surviving soldiers will tell their grandchildren how they saved Constantinople this day. Yeah. Oh, I guess you get an extra 25 HP for a short time. Which is something, I suppose. I still feel like I'm missing transports. Oh, there are two over here. We can just prepare this, because I think the, uh, the pretenders eventually invade us no matter what we do. Um, you guys aren't stuck, right? Alright. Now we got ourselves a big old army. I say big old army and we have 50 pop. It's all relatively speaking. Start repairing that, I suppose. All right. Oh, they're bringing in some mangoes, too. 
Well, let's keep clearing cities in Anatolia. And then we can go after the Turks. And then we'll go after the Normans. Oh, find the Lost Army. I definitely don't remember a Lost Army. Ah. Right. Now with those guys down, we can go ahead, start bombarding that. Okay. Um. First, I want to get dry dock. Next, I want to get a couple traps. Uh, I mean, okay, we are facing a bunch of horsey boys. So it does feel only appropriate that we get Halb. Okay, so all these units follow our, our own upgrades. Good old Badonka Donks. I wonder if I can range everything. Alright. Um, let's bring a transport back over. I think we destroy the towers, then we get whatever city this is. Okay. Come on, Vominos. And I lost another drummond. Okay, so I can make another one. Why aren't we getting whatever the city is? There's nothing else in here. Ah, Antioch! The land of holy hand grenades. Antioch I thought was a little more this way, but obviously you have to take some liberties. Should get more crusaders.
this back up a little bit. Anyway, I have no idea what's further inland. Like, I don't know if we can go all the way to Baghdad or whatever. Oh, we can heal up our injured units. Cash money. I can go all the way up to Rams. I don't know. Uh, I'll get Rams. Oh, wait, the food price isn't going back down at this point. Uh oh. Come on. Hey, what's up? There's something over here that I just never noticed this whole time. That seems possible. Anything over here? Here it is. Anyway, we shouldn't have any issues with these guys. I mean, they do have a mangonel, which is a little annoying, but I think we'll be okay. Dessa. And we'll just double check, make sure there isn't anything over there. And we can send in the rest of our army army to clear up uh, the Fatimids. I don't know if this is a bugger, though. I... I don't especially love the idea that you have to get you have to get all of your non-gold resources by buying them at the market. And the market prices don't reset. <laughs> Well, I mean, we're not so much as conquering Tripoli as uh, obliterating it. Alright, so we've got, gone all along the coast over here. I'm pretty sure they have stuff over here, the, the Seljuks. See if I can, can't get a few Mamelukes in my army. Of the elite variety, even. Oh no, I converted it, but then it died. Wait, no, 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 no. Oh, come on.
Where did you guys, where were you guys hiding? Right. Go back over this way. I'm getting that cash money. Although I don't know what there is left to defeat. Kind of got up. Oh, there's one Eastern Swordsman. Blesses the faithful by defeating the Fatimids. The Fatimids. Jerusalem has been cleared for pilgrims. Yep, oh, gotta be careful of those. Go, go, new transport. Mechanics. Well, I still need to find the lost army or whatever, so I kind of have to explore all over the place, regardless. Yeah, that's what that's what I thought. Prices are climbing for both food and wood. Uh oh. Oh, they do have a fortified tower, though. So we can't just drum in our way out of everything. Oh, looks like they have a camp over here that we need to take out. Oh, that's right, trebuchets. I don't have those. Is it worth going into cataphracts, though? Because the Sicilians mostly have knights with, like, just a couple sergeants. Oh. I wonder if this is the lost army. Yep. <laughs> oh, rip. Looks like they have some more camp over that way. Whoa! Okay, at the very least... It doesn't seem... Like it's going above a hundred. Maybe it's just like our income is getting too high. So they up the market prices. Although to be fair, that kind of feels like you're reducing the whole point of getting the extra revenue in the first place. It's like you're only nominally growing more powerful because everything's now more expensive. You guys up over this way. Just keep on keeping on. I mean, we've done all of the side quests. Hmm. 
Mm, actually, guys, I think this is going to be a good place to stop. That way, next episode, we can go through and annihilate everyone else in our path. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.